In this video, we'll talk about another form of writing equation of a straight line. This one look like this. If we have x over a plus y over b equals 1, then you can clearly see the intercepts. If I have a straight line like this, so this is the point here is a comma 0. That means x intercept. And this is the point here is 0 comma b, which is y intercept. And then what is the slope? As you see the line here, if I consider A and B both are positive, so then my line has negative slope, so we need to put a minus in here. And you see that this is B and this is A, so the slope is B over A, right? So now let me take an example. Say so that I have X over 3 plus Y over 7 equals 1. So from this, I'm getting the intercepts like 3 comma 0, 0 comma 7, and the slope m is negative 7 over 3. You just identify here that a is 3, b equals 7. Let me take another example. Say I have x over 9 minus y over 7 equals 1. So then in this case, a is 9 and b is negative 7. So then the slope is m, which is negative. So b is negative 7, a is 9. So that gives me 7 over 9. And if you want to draw the picture, you can easily see that the intercepts a has 9 units here and b has negative 7 units here. So then the line goes like this. And then the first one, if you draw, you see x has 3 units in here. And y has, say, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 units here. So then the line passes through this. So this is 3 units in here, 7 units there. Let me take another example. And we want to transfer this one to the intercept form. So that you have 5x plus 9y equals 45, for example. So what we need to do, the right-hand side, we need to make 1. So divide by 45. And each term we divide by 45. So then you get x over 9 plus y over 5 equals 1. So then x intercept will be 9 comma 0. Y intercept will be 0 comma 5. And the slope m will be negative 5 over 9. Then you can have another example, say 2x plus 4y equals 3. And to divide both sides by 3. So now you are getting 2 over 3x plus 4 over 3y equals 1. So I don't need to keep 2 here. So how do you move it? So we can write in the next line x over 3 over 2 plus y over 3 over 4 equals 1. And how do you do that? You divide numerator by 2, denominator by 2. That makes it 3 over 2. And the second part, you divide numerator by 4, denominator by 4. That gives you this one. So in this case, now you see the intercepts are 3 over 2, comma 0, 0, comma 3 over 4. And the slope, m, will be minus b over a. So b is 3 over 4 and a is 3 over 2. And then for the simplification, it will give you 3 over 4 times 2 third. So 3, 3 cancelled out. You get negative 1 half. That is your slope. Thank you.